He is known for his extensive studies in philosophy, particularly in the field of theology. He is recognized for his impressive academic achievements, obtaining multiple degrees from prestigious universities. His name is Edgar S. Brightman. Edgar S. Brightman, a renowned philosopher, embarked on a profound journey of self-discovery and intellectual exploration. Born into a Methodist family in Holbrook, Massachusetts, on September 20, 1884, Brightman's upbringing instilled in him a deep sense of spirituality and a thirst for knowledge. His parents, fervent believers in the power of education, encouraged him to immerse himself in various schools of thought and artistic pursuits. Brightman's academic pursuits led him to Brown University, where he honed his intellectual prowess and graduated with a Bachelor of Arts degree in 1907, followed by a Master of Arts degree in 1908. Eager to delve deeper into the realms of theology and philosophy, he pursued a Bachelor of Sacred Theology degree at Boston University, which he obtained in 1910. Driven by an insatiable curiosity, Brightman ventured to Italy, where he pursued further studies at the University of Berlin and Marburg University between 1901 and 1910. Throughout his academic journey, Brightman's thirst for knowledge was matched only by his commitment to spiritual exploration. In 1912, he was ordained as a Methodist minister, a role that allowed him to intertwine his philosophical insights with his religious beliefs. This fusion of spirituality and intellectual inquiry would become a defining aspect of Brightman's life and work. As Brightman delved deeper into the realms of philosophy and theology, he grappled with the concept of eternal recurrence. He once remarked, my life will recur in exactly identical fashion. This statement encapsulated his belief in the cyclical nature of existence, where life and its experiences would repeat indefinitely. Brightman's philosophical musings on eternal recurrence sparked contemplation and debate, inviting individuals to ponder the interconnectedness of their own lives and the timeless patterns that govern the universe. Edgar S. Brightman's profound intellectual contributions and his unique perspective on spirituality and philosophy continue to inspire generations of thinkers. His legacy as a philosopher, theologian, and minister remains a testament to the enduring power of human curiosity and the quest for understanding the mysteries of existence. Edgar S. Brightman, a renowned philosopher and professor, dedicated his life to the pursuit of knowledge and understanding. Born in 1884, he embarked on a remarkable journey that would shape his philosophical views and impact countless individuals. Brightman's career took him from Nebraska Wesleyan University to Wesleyan University in Connecticut and finally to Boston University, where he taught philosophy until his passing in 1953. Throughout his career, Brightman delved into various philosophical subjects, including ethics, religion, and biblical studies. One of his notable contributions was his exploration of the documentary hypothesis, a theory that challenged traditional interpretations of the Bible. Drawing upon the findings of higher criticism, Brightman embraced the idea that the first five books of the Bible were a composite creation, compiled from multiple sources over time. His support for this theory, influenced by the works of Julius Wellhausen, led to criticism and backlash from conservative and fundamentalist Methodists, who adhered to a more traditional belief in the divine origins of the Pentateuch. Despite the challenges he faced, Brightman remained steadfast in his pursuit of intellectual honesty and social activism. He actively engaged with the Methodist Church in America and joined the Methodist Federation for Social Action, advocating for social justice and equality. He also supported conscientious objectors during times of war and was a member of organizations such as the American Civil Liberties Union and the Committee on Peace Through Justice. Brightman's philosophy was deeply rooted in the belief that individuals should question and challenge prevailing beliefs and systems. He understood the importance of critical thinking and the pursuit of truth. As he once famously said, my life will recur in exactly identical fashion. This statement reflects his belief in the cyclical nature of life and the opportunity for personal growth and transformation. By embracing this philosophy, individuals can find meaning and purpose in their daily lives, continually striving to overcome challenges and seek truth. Edgar S. Brightman's contributions to philosophy and his commitment to social justice continue to resonate today. His exploration of biblical studies and his willingness to challenge traditional interpretations inspire us to think critically and question established norms. In a world that often presents us with moral and intellectual dilemmas, Brightman's teachings remind us of the importance of integrity, open-mindedness, and the pursuit of knowledge. Edgar, a philosopher deeply influenced by Borden Parker Bound, embraced the concept of transcendental empiricism, put forth by the Methodist philosopher. Bound emphasized the significance of personality in self-image, believing in the existence of a reality beyond human sensory perceptions. He stressed the role of intuition in understanding reality and upheld the importance of human free will. This philosophy, 
known as personalism, anticipated ideas later explored by Sigmund Freud and even Albert Einstein's theories on the relativity of time and space. Building upon Bound's ideas, Edgar became a proponent of Boston personalism, a movement that centered around the dominance of the human self as the metaphysical reality. His method of argument, known as rational empiricism, aimed to reconcile reason and experience in philosophical discourse. In addition to developing Bound's concepts, Edgar formulated a metaphysical view called finitistic theism in the philosophy of religion. He proposed that God is a self-limited being, whose perfect goodwill is constrained by his own nature. Edgar envisioned a dynamic relationship between God and the world, one that evolves and grows over time. Despite the existence of pain and suffering, he believed that through the processes of the world and history, evil would ultimately be overcome. Edgar's ideas on the evolving relationship between God and the world aligned closely with process philosophy, as advocated by Alfred North Whitehead and Charles Hartshorn. Edgar's philosophical journey was also influenced by Akilananda, a leader of the Ramakrishna mission in Boston. He developed a deep appreciation for mystical experiences, considering them to be of the highest possible consciousness. In his view, mystical experiences were characterized by a combination of being, knowledge, and bliss, transcending ordinary consciousness. This understanding of divine personality resonated with Western personalists and theists. Edgar's influence extended beyond academia, as he served as a teacher and mentor to Martin Luther King Jr. during his pursuit of a PhD at Boston University. King was profoundly impacted by Edgar's book, A Philosophy of Religion, and yearned for the religious experience that Edgar eloquently described. Edgar's teachings played a significant role in shaping King's philosophy of nonviolence, particularly reflected in the principle that the arc of the moral universe is long, but it bends toward justice. Do you want to explore more philosophers? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.